And we are back. Day one of the YNW Melly trial. The high stakes battle begins. YNW Melly, born Jamel, Maurice Demons, rose to fame in the hip hop industry with the hits like Murder on My Mind and Mixed Personalities. Unfortunately, his success was accompanied by legal troubles in February 2019. Melly was arrested and charged with two counts of first-degree murder for the deaths of his close friends and fellow artists, Anthony Williams, a.k.a. YNW Sack Chaser, and Christopher Thomas Jr., a.k.a. YNW Juvie. Now, the assistant state attorney, Christine Bradley, presented her version of events stating that Melly shot and killed his two friends, Christopher Thomas and Anthony Williams, and laid out the evidence that would be presented in trial. The prosecution showed an Instagram message from Melly after the murders where he responds to a message asking if he's okay with the words, I did that. The state argues that this message is an admission of guilt. Now, Melly's defense attorney, David A. Howard, claims that the Miramar police conducted a sloppy investigation and points out the incompetence in their work. He argues that the Broward Sheriff's Office had to start from scratch after evaluating the case. By pointing out contradictions in the driver's narrative, and the presence of gunpowder on his clothing, Howard casts doubt on the validity of the inquiry. He makes the implication that there could be further suspects in the case. Now, there is lack of evidence. The defense focuses on the fact that there is no firearm, no video evidence connecting Melly to the killings. They contend that the prosecution's case mainly depends on circumstantial evidence and falls short of demonstrating Melly, Melly's involvement in the murder. Now, as part of their argument, the prosecution brings up gang links, which suggests a motivation for the killings. The evidence connecting Melly to any gang connection, however, and whether it directly links him to the murders are both disputed by the defense. Now, it is difficult to overlook how much the trial has affected the hip hop scene as it proceeds. YNW, a sizable fan following that was enthralled by Melly's songs and image is now coping with the trial's ominous shadow. The verdict in this case might have significant ramifications. The verdict in this case might have significant ramifications for the rap scene. The relationship between art and morality artists. <clears throat> the verdict in this case might have significant ramifications for the rap scene. Additionally, it shows the difficulty society faces when artists are accused of crimes. The YNW Melly's trial opening day was a suspenseful beginning to this high profile case. The hip hop world excitedly anticipates a decision that will surely affect YNW Melly's career in the future and the potential repercussions it may have on the industry as a whole as the prosecution and the defense continue to present their cases. While we wait for this trial to play out, it's vital to keep in mind that the law will finally decide whether Melly is guilty or innocent while honoring the victims and their families who are fighting for justice. So tell me what y'all think about the day one of the YNW Melly trial. Don't forget to hit that like button, man. Hit that follow button if you haven't. Peace, I'm out.